What's going on guys, Jerry Neutron here, and today we're gonna to take a look at this single monitor arm by a company named Loctec. Now, they also make dual, triple, and quadruple arm mounts, but the one we're taking a look at today is their D7A model, which is made for single monitors between 10 and 27 inches. So let's get everything out of the box and see what we're working with. So first impression, this thing is pretty solid. And it's made from aircraft grade aluminum, so I don't see durability being a factor at all here. Also, the base of this thing is pretty cool because it has a USB 3.0 port, as well as mic and audio jacks. Now, I'm a big fan of this because it's a good place to charge my phone or connect an external hard drive, or if I had a mod mic, I wouldn't have to run it all the way to the back of my computer. Now, adjustment wise, you've got two separate arms with 90 degrees of swivel rotation. Each arm also has these plastic pieces for cable management. Uh, they do kind of feel cheap in comparison to the rest of the unit, but it's not a huge deal. You also get 90 degrees of swivel at the joint just before the ball joint, which will allow you to kind of fine tune your monitor placement. Now at the ball joint, you have a vase amount which supports either 75 by 75 or 100 by 100 millimeter mounting holes. The ball joint also allows you to set your monitor in landscape or portrait mode, which is nice, as well as give you up to 15 degrees of tilt. The top arm even gives you height adjustment. All you have to do is fine tune the gas spring once your monitor is mounted by adjusting this screw, and then you can choose your monitor height. Now by default, my monitor does not have a base amount, so I'm gonna be using this adapter. Once this monitor is mounted, you can see how easy it is to adjust the monitor height and how it doesn't move once it's in place. Seeing how solid it is here really makes me regret not buying a monitor with a vase amount. Now on the other end of this, installing the arm to your desk is either done by this clamp, which is the route I've gone, or you can permanently install it by drilling a hole into your desk and using what they call the grommet method. So once the monitor is mounted and the arm is in place, from there you can fine tune its placement by adjusting the swivel and height. I still need to sort out the cable management, but initially it looks pretty good. It's also nice having a monitor that's at eye level without the need for a monitor stand and this looks much cleaner in my opinion. So overall I've been pretty impressed with this monitor arm. It's got a solid construction, plenty of adjustability, and I think it's a little overkill for a home setup honestly. Now, this is something I would expect to see in a corporate environment where durability is more of a concern as opposed to a home office. Price wise it's going to set you back a little bit but I think that's the only real negative here. Uh, if you either A want something premium to hold your expensive G-Sync or FreeSync monitor or B you need this for an office environment then this is definitely something you should consider. So let me know what you guys think about this monitor arm down in the comments below. Uh, is this something you would consider purchasing or is there something out there that does what you want for less? Uh, don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful or entertaining. Subscribe if you haven't already and until next time, see ya. So they make a bunch of PC gaming peripherals based on Greek mythology and the keyboard they've sent me today is called the Hermes Lite.